What's up guys, welcome to my channel. Um, I recently just bought this 2005 uh, Yamaha Banshee as you've seen in my previous videos. Um, I started looking over the machine, I started doing maintenance and stuff on it, and I've I, I seen that my chain is really loose. It's got like a two and a half inch travel on it, and uh, it needs to be tightened up. So I'm gonna show you guys how to tighten it up. All right guys, so, this is how much travel I had in this thing when I bought it. That's that's a lot of travel. So um, the dealer recommends about 1.6 inches of travel. So I'll probably put it between like an inch and a half to an inch, probably one inch. Remember when you sit on it, it's gonna tighten up a little bit. Um, all right, so you got this long bolt up here, which is a 17, all right? And then you got this adjustment screw with a 12 adjustment screw with the 12 and then underneath here this bar right here there's another one and it's a 17 with a 14 end so I brought my tools out I got my wrenches sockets ratchet wrenches all right and then I got my lube so you want to lube all these points point here point here because that's what's going to slide you want to do your nut your adjustment screws all right and then you want to do your nut down there and then you could do the joints right there all right so i'm gonna get going i'm gonna ratchet this off and i'm gonna tighten these up for you all right guys so you got your 17 through here that you can reach through here grab your 17 wrench over here loosen it with a ratchet I actually already loosened these so they're loose already right and then you got your adjustment screws right here this is a 12 so take a 12 like this wrench them off 12 like this wrench them off all right and then you got your 14 right down here Which you gotta get through here. Like this. You have to move it around. And then you hold the 17 through here. And this one, I didn't loosen yet. I didn't loosen that up. there guys so when you sit on it it's gonna you see it tightens leave right about there so I'm gonna hold this like this tighten this this nut right here is a lock nut And guys, you don't have to kill that nut because that's not really what's holding this thing in place. That's just an adjustment screw. If you guys had to put your life in, in that bolt, uh, there'd be problems. But you do want to tighten it up. Remember, lefty loosey, righty tighty. I'm gonna go ahead and tighten the. I'll tighten the bottom one first. With the 14. With a 17 end. Which you could grab another 17 if you want. And put it through here. 
and hold both ends with a ratchet. So that's tight, and then the tops are 17, which you're going to tighten them for the, from the nut side. I'll make sure that shit's tight, guys. Because that shit holds your rear straight. Alright, so this is tight. This top nut's tight. Bottom nut's tight. And, uh, yeah. Should be good. Alright, guys, well, we're all done with adjusting the chain. Um, I gave it like an inch to maybe an inch and a half travel, but when you sit on it, it will get tighter. Um,. This is also an old chain. If you guys put a new chain on this thing, you're going to have to adjust it a few times because it is going to stretch. Um, this machine's got a lot of power, so it does put a lot of stress on your chain. All right, so don't forget, guys, you need a 17, a 14, um, 17, 14, a 12, and a 10 millimeter. Your 17's up here. You got a 17 here. You also got a 17 nut here, all right? You got a 12 millimeter locking nut here for the adjustment screw, 10 millimeter for the adjustment screw. And then underneath here, you got a 17 on this side and a 14 on this side. And you're always gonna loosen the, the bolt from the nut side. So this side and this side. And then you get them through these holes, all right? With, the, um, with a ratchet. You go right through the holes, they don't line up roll the machine back and forth all right and after you guys ride it make sure the bolts are tight you know you want to always check your bolts well thanks subscribe and um many more videos to come on the yamaha banshee thank you bye